There are two types of reasoning that we use in geometry, inductive reasoning and deductive reasoning, and often we like to compare the two. Deductive reasoning is the process of reasoning logically from given statements to a conclusion. So let's say you wanted to have a later curfew. To justify it to your parents, you're going to have to use deductive reasoning and say something to, along the lines of, I'm a responsible person, I get good grades, I've been able to honor every other curfew. So basically you need to back yourself up to make your, your statement that you think that you need a later curfew. To give you a little more idea of what is deductive reasoning compared to inductive reasoning, let's say I asked you to prove that this quadrilateral QUAD is a parallelogram. And I told you that QD is parallel to UA and that QU is parallel to DA. So if I just mark these, that QD parallel to UA and that QU is parallel to AD, this process of what you would use, a proof, that is called deductive reasoning because you're using given information to make a proven statement. Now, to compare this with inductive reasoning, let's say I gave you th these three shapes and I said draw the next shape in the sequence. Well, you're going to see that we have an equilateral triangle, an equilateral quadrilateral, and an equilateral pentagon. So you're going to observe the pattern that all of these shapes are going up in one number of side and that the sides are all congruent. It's an equilateral figure. So you know that the next shape in the sequence will be an equilateral hexagon. There, you didn't have a given statement, you didn't prove anything, you just saw the pattern and you reached a conclusion of what the next shape would be. So this would be inductive reasoning. If you're ever given a quiz question where it says, is this inductive or deductive reasoning, ask yourself, are you being asked to prove or show something and justify it, or are you just observing something and making a conclusion based on patterns that you see? And that'll tell you if it is inductive or deductive reasoning.